y'all what is up welcome back to my channel it's me shelby aka simply shelby welcome back or if you're new here hello welcome my name's shelby today i felt like doing a random like day in my life vlog it's a saturday i'm really busy today every girl works nine to five during the week time has a part-time job and edits videos on the side so your girl it's saturday i got a lot of stuff to do today and i'm gonna try to get all done today so if you're interested in going along with my day today and having a fun little vlog moment i would love it if you stay tuned and if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel and join my shell squad it would mean so much to me give this video a thumbs up if you're feeling my vibe and turn on the post notification bell so that way you get notified every time i upload a new video and let's get into it I'm getting Dunkin' right now. I'm just in line and yeah, we're gonna get coffee and then we're just gonna go on about our day I'm gonna retry the like pink velvet macchiato because I tried it last year and it was pretty good So I want to retry it today and we'll see how that is. So let's try that Good morning, thank you for choosing Dunkin' What can I try to feel? Hi, can I get a small um, pink velvet macchiato, please? All right Ice. Okay. And that should be all. 397 Okay, thank you. Y'all. Today, we got the pink velvet macchiato. So I went to Dunkin' first because your girl needs some coffee. Isn't she cute? Like, wow. Pretty, pretty drink. So the pink velvet macchiato, it's supposed to kind of taste like red velvet cake, I think. Red velvet cupcake type of thing. I tried it last year, which I do have a video on, which is like really hectic, but... You know, I'll link it in case anyone wants to see that. It was one of my like first videos, so don't judge me. It's hectic, but yeah, today we're trying out this pink velvet macchiato gun. Super excited. It looks so cute. And yeah, I just need a coffee. I feel like Dunkin' drinks are stronger. Let me know down below what you think. But like, I feel like Dunkin' drinks are stronger, but we needed coffee to start off the day. It's as good as I remember, like. I really like it. Like, I guess I'm not a big red velvet person or I don't eat red velvet cake too much. But you know what it reminds me of? Like, if have you ever had a white mocha with like raspberry mixed in? If you like coffee drinks with like white mocha and raspberry, it gives me those vibes. Like it's very white mocha raspberry vibes, so it's pretty good. Honestly, I recommend it tastes strong like I feel like if you get a specialty drink like this at Starbucks It's really really sweet, but here you could definitely see the espresso on top However kind of espresso it is but honestly, it's good And I do recommend I feel like it was cheaper than last year because I bought it last year and in my video I swear it's like 407 but this year is like under four dollars So maybe they like switch up the price, but yeah, it was a little bit cheaper this year I think which is good 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 under four dollars i think is a great deal for like specialty drink but yeah this is a drink and y'all today i've been having a week so i was like now that i'm out of my house a little bit of breathing room this is what happened to me this week get this I was driving with my mom right we were driving we were chilling we got some starbucks like everything was good then all of a sudden she's like oh yeah i donated your clothes and i'm like okay like i had one bag of clothes i was gonna donate and i told her but there's another bag of clothes that had all of my summer clothes in it. So I kind of freaked out and I was like, what, what clothes did you bring? And she's like, both bags. And I was like, both bags? No, 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 no. I was like, both bags? And I kind of freaked out, like, and I was like, both bags. So I ran in the house and I realized my bag of all my summer clothes were gone, poof, gone. And I started bawling because I love my summer, like, clothes, so it's cold where i live there's snow right now so i put away my summer clothes and i feel like people do this anyways but i put away my summer clothes and bring out my winter clothes and all my summer clothes were gone you guys gone and i was just bawling my eyes out like i know maybe you can guess what zodiac sign i am by now you comment down below if you can guess but literally i was crying all day because all my summer clothes were gone like these were some really cute summer clothes i bought at like specialty boutiques or on vacation and just things I couldn't get back you know so I was just devastated and I know there's way bigger problems right now and 
you may not be that attached to your clothes and maybe I have a problem but I love my clothes so when all my summer clothes were gone I was literally so sad but I got over it like a couple days after but I'm still sad because some of those clothes were really cute and now I can never get it back so I didn't even get to say goodbye like Marie Kondo way like bless the clothes say goodbye but it's okay it's okay we move past it I'm not a type of person who likes to stay angry that long at people especially people I love so I'm like okay it's fine like the next day we hugged it out it's okay but yeah so that was my story time for the week you know exciting uh, not exciting just more sad than exciting but yeah that was it that was my week it was very busy week you know I work nine to five I think I've said before and I also work part-time so I'm very very busy throughout the week so Saturdays like today are just like my chill day and it's fun to be spending it with y'all so next thing I'm gonna do now that we got our coffee is I'm gonna I have this like corset thing which I'll show you when I get back that I'm gonna try to make into like a corset belt it will make more sense so let's go back home and start to make that okay so here's the corset thing I was talking about so it was like a full-on almost like really long pencil skirt but the top part was like this corset um, you know like underwire boob thing so what I did was I cut it already I cut it in half and what I'm hoping to do is to create like a like a belt type of thing if you know what I mean like I'll wear a tighter shirt later but basically like a belt that's gonna go like something like this with the ribbing just underneath so we're gonna try that but the thing is like it has this zipper back here so I might sew it up to where like the zipper is but we got to figure that out but yeah so this is a little project i'm going to be working on and try to get situated so let's do that and you know once i'm done i'll show you all what the kind of like end result of this corset thingy is but yeah it's kind of random this is what i wanted to do today so <laughs> this is what we're gonna do so yeah let's hope that it works out well cross my fingers So the corset, she is um, done, but let me say, <laughs> I probably wouldn't wear it out in public. Let me clear my throat. <laughs> I probably wouldn't wear it out in public, but this is what she's looking like. Okay, so like this part, as you can see, the lines are so bad. Don't look at that, but like from afar, from afar. Hold on, Let me, let's switch up the angle really quick. From afar though, she could maybe pass, she can maybe pass by, but one second. Okay, I got a black jacket. I'm gonna show you the corset again. I don't think I'm gonna keep it. It did not turn out as I wanted, but you know, it's okay. So, here she is, okay. <laughs> So I just tried to style it really quick, like if I were to maybe style a corset thing. So I got like an oversized plaid jacket, I'm just wearing like this tighter black shirt. And then I put the corset under like, I don't know, I think just the under wire is weird on this corset thing. Like it's not that tight. And I feel like for these, you need them to be really, really tight, which like I could try to cinch in, but to be honest, I'm not a sewer. And then just some of this is popping up. And as you saw earlier in my sew job, oops, but my sole job was just not it was not good she's uh, it's a little disappointing but it is okay trial and error i'll probably just end up buying a corset thing so if you comment down below if you know where to get like a cute corset belt because i really want one but this did not work out for me so hold on let me just show you guys it off but yeah this is how it looks i don't think i'll wear it because if anyone gets up close they're gonna be like ew that's gross but i want to show you guys the corset thing up close again <laughs> okay see look it's just like really bad sew job you know like fifth grader some fifth graders <laughs> oh my gosh terrible some fifth grader is probably better than you know sewing and look at the inside we won't even talk about that we won't even talk about that but yeah this is the thing i tried to sew this was going in the trash probably i don't think i need her 
But yeah, let's carry on with the day. Okay, next thing I'm gonna do y'all is I got this bag of clothes in front of me that I'm gonna take to Plato's closet because I'm gonna see if I can sell any of it and get any cash, cash money. So let's go sell the clothes. Hopefully, I feel like they're pretty picky with what they take back, but let's hope they take some items today. Okay, update on Plato's Closet. Went there, they only gave me like 22 bucks. I don't even know what they took, I'll check after. But yeah, I only got like 22 bucks. That's okay, better than nothing. So now I'm just gonna go back home and chill out because I'm tired. I feel like I did so much today and I just wanna rest. So I'm going back home and we just gonna chill. Okay, so I'm back home and I thought I was gonna rest. I'm taking out the top part of my makeup because I wanna wear a hat and I <laughs> I don't want it to get out there. Look at that difference. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. But my friend, he really wants to go on a walk. So we're gonna go on a walk and then we'll chill out after this. But oh my gosh, this is so funny. Don't look. But yeah, here's my friend. Ready? Here's my friend. I told him that we would go on a walk, but like now he's kind of crazy and he stalks me. I know, we're gonna go soon. Tell the people. Tell them. You wanna go on a walk? I know you do. Oh, okay, see, he's crazy now. Okay, we're gonna do, oh. Chill, chill, we're gonna go. Tell the people. Chill. It's a few hours later now. I still have the plaid jacket on. I'm still disappointed about the corset, but I think we're gonna end the vlog here. I hope that you enjoyed this random day in the life vlog. Honestly, it's quite hectic. Like, these are my days. They're hectic, they're the life of Shelby. That's what I would say. So that was the day in the life vlog. I'll probably try to do more, but I just feel like things aren't that exciting right now. Just like quarantine and stuff like that. But today I just had random things to do like the corset, which failed. But yeah, anyways, so I'm gonna end it here. I appreciate you watching. Hit the like button if you know you like the chaos or things like that. Comment down below if you tried the pink velvet macchiato drink. And with that being said, I hope you all have a wonderful day. I would love it if you subscribe to my channel, join my shell squad, turn on the post notification bell, that way you get notified every time I upload a new video. And I'll see y'all next time, bye. Mm -hmm.